Hey guys, a lot going on. It is last day of the holiday. I got little birdies out here in two of the, I don't know if you can hear me because of the wind. I have two uh, pet carriers end to end, got the doors open and got them end to end. Now the birds outside grazing. Um, Mom and Dad left uh, three hours ago and I took the birds out and then I tilled, I shoveled the soil that I had in a heap over here and then I tilled this half of the garden. That's ready to plant, okay? That's ready to go. Um, sorry, it's really windy. And over here I'm working on the lawnmower. I don't know if you can tell. The, the grass needs cutting. Probably doesn't show well. The grass really needs cutting. And I'm working on my lawnmower. I bought that for $20 um, last year and never ran it. It sputtered, so I knew it was going to be good. So I brought this with me from New York. And I've been cleaning the carburetor. I'm not recording much because I'm all filthy. But uh, I'm going to put this on here and hopefully be able to cut my lawn. So we'll see how it goes. Well guys, it runs, but it doesn't run. Uh, the engine runs, but there's a couple problems. One is the uh, throttle um, adjustment. There's no tension in there, so I've got to figure out how to put more tension on the throttle because it uh, keeps running itself down and shuts itself off. That's a bad thing. And the other is the drive is a friction wheel. So the drive pulley under the engine touches another pulley on the shaft, the drive shaft, and um, well, it's supposed to, but there's a little gap in there so it's not touching. I'm guessing there's a spring missing. So I'm not gonna mow my lawn today. I've gotta get this up on a, on a rack and see why it's not um, engaging down there but I think I'll be able to get it running hopefully if I can get a spring up in there get it running and we'll be alright <laughs> 